Ever wondered how a small creature like a monkey can transmit a disease as severe as monkeypox? It's a fascinating question, isn't it? Monkeypox, as the name suggests, traces its roots back to monkeys, but it doesn't stop there. This disease is a part of the larger zoonotic family, which includes diseases transmitted from animals to humans. Interestingly, monkeypox doesn't just involve monkeys. It's also linked to rodents, such as Gambian rats, dormice, and squirrels. These small creatures, often living in close proximity to humans in certain parts of the world, serve as reservoirs of the virus. The monkeypox virus then makes the leap to humans, causing a variety of symptoms, some of which are quite severe. But how does a disease from such small creatures grow to have such a significant impact on human health? That's what we're going to delve into. Let's see how this disease originating in such small creatures can have such large impacts. Starting our countdown at number 10, monkeypox is considered a rare disease. Now when we say rare, we're talking about a disease that's not frequently encountered. But don't let the term fool you, rare doesn't mean non-existent. The World Health Organization reports that since the turn of the 21st century, there have been sporadic outbreaks of monkeypox in several countries, notably in Central and West Africa. However, compared to other infectious diseases, the number of monkeypox cases reported each year is relatively low. Now this doesn't mean we can rest easy. Monkeypox is a serious disease that can cause severe illness, and even death in some cases. It's important for health organizations and individuals alike to stay vigilant and informed about this disease. Although rare, monkeypox still poses a significant threat to human health. Coming in at number 9, monkeypox is often compared to smallpox. And it's not just because of the pox in their names. These two diseases share striking similarities. Both are viral infections that present with fever, headache, muscle aches, and characteristic skin rashes. They're also both members of the orthopox virus family, making them distant relatives. However, let's not forget the differences. Smallpox was a global killer, responsible for millions of deaths throughout history. On the other hand, monkeypox is primarily confined to Central and West Africa, with sporadic outbreaks elsewhere. Also, while smallpox was eradicated by a global vaccination campaign, monkeypox is still with us. The skin rash in monkeypox is usually less severe and develops later than in smallpox, and there's one more difference. Monkeypox, as the name suggests, can be transmitted from animals to humans. Despite the similarities, monkeypox is distinct in many ways. At number 8, there is no known cure for monkeypox. A chilling statement, isn't it? Despite our advancements in medical science, the fight against monkeypox remains an uphill battle. There is currently no specific treatment or vaccine available for this disease. It's a stark reality we must face. When a person contracts monkeypox, the healthcare approach primarily involves managing the symptoms. This could include balancing the body's fluids, managing fever, and addressing complications that could arise from the disease. It's a reactive approach, dealing with the disease's effects rather than preventing them outright. The lack of a cure puts a spotlight on the importance of prevention. Staying away from animals that could potentially carry the virus, maintaining good hygiene and avoiding close contact with infected individuals are key. Remember, in the absence of a cure, prevention isn't just the best defense, it's the only defense. Without a cure, prevention becomes crucial. Number 7 on our list, monkeypox can be fatal. While monkeypox may appear as a benign rash to the untrained eye, it holds a dangerous potential. The mortality rate of this disease varies significantly, influenced by a range of factors. These factors can include the individual's overall health, their age, and their geographical location. The World Health Organization estimates that monkeypox has a mortality rate of between 1 to 10 percent, with severe cases often occurring in individuals with weaker immune systems, particularly among children. It's also important to note that the Central African variant of monkeypox is more severe than the West African variant. The latter has a lower fatality rate, but still poses a significant threat. The fact that monkeypox can be fatal, coupled with its ability to spread from person to person, makes it a truly formidable disease. The potential for fatality makes monkeypox a disease to be taken seriously. At number 6, monkeypox can spread from human to human. This transmission can occur in a variety of ways. One of the most common is through direct contact with the blood, bodily fluids, or rash of an infected person. Even just touching the bed linens or clothing of someone with monkeypox can lead to transmission. It's also possible to get monkeypox if you're in close proximity to a person with the disease and they cough or sneeze. 
This is because the virus can live in respiratory droplets and become airborne. It's important to note that the virus is most transmissible during the rash phase, when the person is most symptomatic. It's less likely to spread during the incubation period, which is the time between when a person is infected and when they start showing symptoms. This human-to-human -human transmission increases the risk of an outbreak. Coming in at number 5, monkeypox was first identified in 1958. The world was introduced to this new disease in the Democratic Republic of Congo, previously known as the Belgian Congo. It was during an outbreak of a pox-like disease among monkeys kept for research that monkeypox made its debut. The virus was initially isolated from a captive monkey, hence the name monkeypox. However, it wasn't until a year later that the first human case of monkeypox was documented. The patient was a nine-year-old boy living in a remote village. His symptoms closely resembled those of smallpox, a disease that was still prevalent at the time. Over the subsequent years, researchers have made strides in understanding this disease, yet monkeypox remains largely a mystery. Scientists continue to investigate its transmission, its hosts, and potential treatments. Despite being identified over half a century ago, much about monkeypox remains unknown. At number 4, there have been outbreaks of monkeypox in the United States. Yes, you heard it right. Monkeypox is not confined to the tropical rainforests of Central and West Africa. It has made its way across the Atlantic, all the way to the United States. The first recorded outbreak in the United States occurred in 2003, with more than 70 confirmed cases. This outbreak was traced back to a shipment of exotic pets from Ghana. More recently in 2021, another outbreak was reported, this time involving a Dallas resident who had traveled to Nigeria. This goes to show that diseases do not respect borders, and in our increasingly globalized world, an outbreak in one country can quickly become a concern for all. Monkeypox, though rare, has proven that it can and will spread if given the opportunity. Even in developed countries, monkeypox poses a threat. Coming in at number 3, monkeypox is a zoonotic disease. Now, what exactly does that mean? Well, a zoonotic disease is one that can be transmitted from animals to humans. These diseases can be caused by viruses, bacteria, parasites, and fungi. They're a significant concern to both human and animal health. Monkeypox fits right into this category. It's primarily found in Central and West African countries, where it's transmitted to humans from animals such as rodents and monkeys. The virus can jump from these animals to humans when humans come into close contact with the blood, body fluids, or cutaneous or mucosal lesions of infected animals. In some cases, even indirect contact with animal products can lead to transmission. This zoonotic nature of monkeypox makes it an even more significant concern. It's not just about human-to-human -human transmission, we also have to consider the animal-human interface. The zoonotic nature of monkeypox adds another layer of complexity to its prevention and control. At number 2, monkeypox is a global health concern. This disease, though initially identified in Central and West Africa, has crossed continents, reaching as far as the United States, United Kingdom, and Singapore. The ease of global travel today means that diseases like monkeypox can spread faster and wider than ever before. This is not just a problem for the countries directly affected, but for every nation worldwide. Monkeypox is a concern due to its similarity with the deadly smallpox virus and the fact that it's increasingly being transmitted from human to human. With no specific treatment or vaccine readily available for all, it poses a significant health risk. Moreover, the disease's zoonotic nature originating from animals makes it harder to control and predict. And with the continuing encroachment of human activities into wildlife habitats, the opportunities for such diseases to jump from animals to humans are increasing. The global reach of monkeypox makes it a disease that cannot be ignored. And finally at number one, monkeypox has the potential to cause a global pandemic. This is not idle speculation but a fact based on scientific evidence and historical precedents. Monkeypox, much like its cousin smallpox, can spread rapidly among humans and there's currently no cure for it. Consider the following factors. First, the virus is zoonotic, meaning it can spread from animals to humans, making containment more challenging. Also, monkeypox can be transmitted from human to human, multiplying the risk of a widespread outbreak. Secondly, urbanization and deforestation are increasing human and animal interactions, escalating the chances of zoonotic transmissions. Finally, global travel can carry the virus across continents within hours. The lack of a global immunization program against monkeypox leaves us vulnerable. So, while monkeypox might seem like a distant threat, 
these factors could align to create a perfect storm leading to a global pandemic. The potential for a monkeypox pandemic is the most shocking fact of all. From its rarity to its potential to cause a global pandemic, monkeypox is a disease full of shocking facts. We've journeyed together through a string of startling realities, from the fact that monkeypox is indeed a rare disease, to its chilling similarity to the eradicated smallpox. We've learned that there's currently no cure for monkeypox and it can, in some cases, be fatal. We've also discovered that monkeypox can be transmitted from human to human, and it was first identified way back in 1958. The disease has even made its way to the United States, causing outbreaks. As a zoonotic disease it jumps from animals to humans, making it a global concern. Lastly, the potential for a global pandemic due to monkeypox cannot be overstated. Understanding monkeypox is crucial to preventing its spread and preparing for potential outbreaks. Let's continue to educate ourselves and others about this potentially devastating disease.